Hello my name is Sub-Zero Extabyte and I am shooting right back at you with another video. Today is going to be a fun video and it is going to be very special. We are going to have a lot of fun and by that I mean that we're going to try and break some bedrock that might not sound that special but I can promise you that it is going to be very special. Now this is going to be a new experience for me because I have not tried this in forever so... Now we have been launched into the world of Minecraft. But of course that is something that you guys already knew right? Well right now we are inside of the Minecraft Alpha. I mean who of you guys can honestly say that they have been around long enough to have played the Minecraft Alpha? That is just the best thing ever to be honest. But that might just be me. So right now actually we are getting right back into that nostalgic feeling again. I know that I have talked about this a lot lately. But this is just something that instantly gets me back into a younger Sub-Zero man. Now I really enjoyed playing the Minecraft alpha back in the day and i wish that i could play it even more now so that is one of the reasons why we are doing this today just so that i can feel like a little kid again i mean it used to be kind of hard in minecraft starting out and all of that used to be really hard in my opinion but that might just be me to be honest maybe i was just bad back then or even now but that would be kind of cool though that would actually be really cool to be honest then i could just be sitting here watching movies all day and just criticize and talk trash about the movies all i want that would be really cool i think but then again i know that i would be really biased to a lot of movies because there are just a lot of movies that i love and i really cannot get out of that to be honest that is probably just something that will stick with me for the rest of my life probably and i would not think that i could go without any of the movies that i used to watch because they are just so good and I feel completed because of them. I just feel that it keeps you guys on your feet and at the edge of your seats every time that you are watching one of my videos. That is not too weird now is it? Okay it actually might be. But let's just forget about that because that is not something that I want to do. And you know why? Because that is not something that makes me feel nostalgic at all and I know that this sound rather obvious of course. But right now I am just falling in on all of that. I mean I just want to keep this all on the down low a little right now. Because I just want to feel that one thing that will actually make me feel the most nostalgic of all of these things. And that might actually be really hard to do right now. But I feel like that has been my main goal for this video so if I do not succeed in that well then what would that make me in the first place? I mean there is nothing that I can do that will actually make it feel like something that is nostalgic. But I will find that nostalgic bomb feeling. I mean that is why I am here. So I will do everything in my power to feel that again. Now to be really honest with you guys. It feels actually really good to be back right now. I mean this is like the most fun that I have ever had as a kid and to just be back now and to be able to relive all of that is just amazing. I mean I keep talking about nostalgia and all of that but I just feel like this is amazing. And to be honest sometimes I really just wish that I could be a kid forever and not care about anything in life than just fooling and playing around. Of course becoming an adult and growing up has its perks I guess. But I just really miss playing outside and having fun with my buddies when playing hide and go seek all summer long. I mean for me that was just the real deal. And maybe I just feel like I kind of wasted all of that a little because when you are younger all you want to do is just grow up and grow old i mean right now i feel like i am growing old but i will probably never grow up i will always be that little kid running around on the streets on the inside at least on the outside well not so much but that does not matter probably the only real thing that matters right now is that we are out here playing something that used to just fuel me for nights on end i could just play this all day i remember going to high school and getting my first notebook there because i had to get that for the classes that i had to follow we had to buy one of those fancy new macbooks and stuff not that we used them that much so it was pretty much just a monumental waste of money. But at least I got to play Minecraft on there for the first time ever. And right now you might be like, wait you only got your first notebook when you got into high school. Well yeah, I mean times have changed I guess. And back then you did not have that much tech to be honest. Everyone was still rocking the Apple iPods and stuff like that. It was pretty lit to be honest. But like I said it was a different time. And yes Minecraft did not really exist before I went to high school. At least before 
for that time it was not really on my radar because I was too busy playing Call of Duty on my Xbox back then. Which was also a great way to waste away. But of course none of that has anything to do with me being inside of the Minecraft Alpha. But then when you look at it from another angle, it kind of has everything to do with me being inside of this MC Alpha. Because I am trying to get my life back on the rails, literally. Ha huh, that was a joke and a pun in once. Because we all know that I will probably never get my life together. But at least we have each other and we can do all of this together. So that is why I want to be right here right now with you guys. So that I can have all of the things that I love within a hand's reach. And that is kind of cool because that would mean that I do no longer have to go and travel from Roblox to Minecraft. And of course from Minecraft to Roblox. But it was just insane to me that we have got all of this down right now. And right now we can actually start to think about settling down and start taking it slow for a while. But I am still considering that fact. And it is nothing more than a consideration so do not start yelling at me because I will still be here for all of you to comfort you in sad times. And right now is not a sad time because my parkour is actually looking pretty fly for a white guy. And what do you guys think about this right here? This looks pretty cool right? So right now I can actually have a cool view from the top of my house when I am doing a parkour. But of course this is just a little training parkour so that I can become even better when I can just practice whenever I want. So that is pretty cool if you ask me, and especially if you know the meaning behind all of this. Because right now I have pretty much put my new house as a center point or a focal point of the parkour. And that is because this new house is the beginning of something new. Something a lot better than what it used to be and that is a good thing whether you believe in it or not. I mean who would not be ready for all of this right? I know that I am pretty hyped for when I can start doing all of this and never have to worry about anything anymore. So I can just do whatever I want all day long. I mean I could be working all day, and I could be recording all day. Or maybe I could just be laying in my bed all day while I am watching my brand new super fat TV and that would be cool too because this is the new me and I'm loving it already and you know what maybe I will be just laying in my bed all day and watching the 4k remaster of the awesome and by awesome I mean really awesome breaking bad I mean who would not want to spend his or her whole day just laying in a bed while watching a breaking bad 4k remaster that is like watching something so cool but then you are not just watching it but you are watching it in 4k which makes it like 4,000 times cooler than it already is. Actually it would make it like only twice as cool, or four times as cool. I am not sure because math is not my strong suit, but I know that it has to be somewhere around two times as good as full HD or four times as good as full HD. But all of that is besides the point because Breaking Bad is already awesome on its own in just full HD and I am loving every bit of it. Oh my god you guys with the music coming in right now. Well this is just making it for me. I mean it was really just a make it or break it moment right there. But this is like the best thing ever to just feel some of that music pumping through my ears. And to be honest I always like to play Minecraft with the music on. Because it is just so soothing that it is just amazing. At least for me that is. I mean maybe some people do not like this as much as me but I feel like it is just the best thing ever for some odd reason I actually do not know why I think it is because I used to always play Minecraft with the music on back in the day and that right now when I hear that music again I just get all frisky and really just nostalgic and stuff like I said Minecraft for me is just the best way to get a little throwback and flashback to when I was a little younger and a little more foolish but that does not matter that is just a part of growing up doing stupid things and regretting them otherwise you will never learn from the things that you do and have done you know this is just too weird for me man I mean I am a pretty weird guy but that has nothing to do with all of this. I mean I probably could get used to it someday. But I am not sure if that day will ever come. Just because I do not handle change all that well so I am pretty sure that this is going to be bothering me until the day that I end up getting some squared blocky stuff again. And I just think that this is way too cool for it to happen to me right now. I don't know man. This is fun. It is just the way Minecraft is supposed to be played and stuff etc. But what do we have here? Wait is this a legit tree right now? This looks so weird. It just looks like some cool thing going all the way touching the skies and stuff man. I am not sure if I should be going in here right now. But I probably should because I am actually pretty curious about all of this and I am actually pretty sure that you guys are all curious as well so I hope that you appreciate me going in here because I am scared to death right now because I do not want any of this to end now. I am just going to be exploring for a bit and while 
while I do that I will tell you guys a quick story about my love for the blocked nature of Minecraft. So it pretty much all started out when I was a lot younger than I am right now, that sounded pretty correct. But I was starting to get into high school and all of that stuff. And basically what happened was that I had this friend of mine who was a couple of years older than me. Wait a second, those are pigs. Oh my god little piggies what do you guys think about all of this? I do not like the circles at all right now. And I cannot be the only one who feels this way right. But okay I am getting sidetracked from my little story time rant. So what I was trying to say. So I had this friend who was a couple of years older than me. And he showed me this game that I had to be playing when I was becoming a freshman. So I was like. Yeah sure install the game bro. And he did and he kind of showed me the ropes of it all. And I just fell in love with it. And this was like way back in the start of Minecraft. So it must have been around the beta or something I think. So I really fell in love with the game and I started exploring and stuff. And of course since Minecraft was still in beta, there was nothing to do except for surviving and building some houses and stuff. I mean you could not even go into creative mode. But still I love the fact that you could choose your own skin, and you could do whatever you want and build whatever you want. And basically everything around that time was just good. Life was good and I am actually getting really nostalgic when I am thinking back at that. But that was my little story time for today. And I hope that you guys like it when I tell you guys some non-fiction stories in some videos when there is time for that of course and please let me know in the comments down below if you would want some more of these story times or if you would want me to just shut my mouth hole and keep going deeper into minecraft which is fine by me of course i mean you guys are the viewers and i am all about that viewer life so let me help you by you helping me helping you or something but i think that i have sidetracked a little bit too much while doing that little bit of story time back there because i have no idea where i am going right now and it is starting to get sundown so I am not sure what I am supposed to do right now but I think that I just should be following my best bet so that I can make sure that I get home safely but right now I am just lost I am wandering and I am lost and I am wondering how in the world this happened to me I mean it is getting dark outside and usually I want to be home before the sun goes down so that I can make sure that nothing freaky happens to me while I am outside. But I am lost so I guess that I'm not safe until I will find my home and get back into it in time to watch some darn adventure time. But where should I be going because I have no clue right now. Everything just looks the same and nothing looks like any place that I'm familiar with. So I am not sure what to do. Maybe I should call someone but I am all alone in here. Like a real Minecraft pro. Why do I have to be so stubborn and not do anything according to plan? I mean I was not supposed to go out alone like that when I am upset about something. This was just stupid to do on my end. But okay so guys my camera cut off through the night because the battery died. Luckily it saved all of the footage and it is charging right now in the sun. Because I have got this little solar panel thing on the top of my camera which will provide it with some juice once I am out of said juice. By the way may I point out that I think that I still have the right amount of knowledge and skills that I need to have in order to successfully survive in this old Minecraft alpha version. I mean I have no idea why that lover in the beginning actually sent me here but I am sure it has a good purpose. Don't you guys think so? You know what? I actually challenge all of you to go and try to survive for at least 3 days and 2 nights in this alpha version of the game because let me tell you it's not that easy you know? Wait a second what is behind that little hill right here? Oh my god it is a freaking ravine. Okay we will have to watch out around this part of the area because this could end up really bad for me because I am not anywhere near qualified to start skydiving without a parachute. But then again I do not think that a lot of people are very good at skydiving without a parachute because you know it would be kind of dangerous to do in my opinion. But you know, I think that people should be doing whatever they would want to do. But I am not going to risk my life on something like that there. Come on guys I still just cannot believe that we are actually doing this right now and to be honest just thinking about ending this video right now is making me a little sad just because I really do not know if you guys are going to like this video because you know if you guys do not like the video then I cannot play this alpha or the beta anymore on camera but if you guys do like it 
Well then I will just have another excuse to go out and play more of the older versions of Minecraft. Which would just be tight like a tiger for me. So please just let me know what you guys think of this video in the comments down below. And if you really 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 like this video then please go ahead and leave a quick like on the video so that I can see that you guys enjoyed it. And of course if you did not enjoy the video then please do not leave a like or just dislike the video. Whatever floats your boat. So that I just can make sure that I actually make videos videos that you guys like and stuff you know but I am going to end the video right here I hope that you enjoyed it and I will see you next time